are just leaving um, Nation. National Marine. Oh, sorry, National Marine, just north of Peoria. And Sam, as you know, we lost the bow thruster in Star Rock Lock. And we had a mechanic come out and uh, look at it. And unfortunately, the boat is going to have to be pulled. So we are without a bow thruster. And this morning was uh, winds and we had uh, very low water, about two feet under the keel. The winds, no bow thruster, and low water, but we got it out and uh, we are on the river and uh, probably gonna do about 60 miles today. And it uh, looks like we're gonna have to anchor. A lot of the marinas are closed due to the high water that they had earlier in the year and uh, they're revamping. So uh, we're looking for places to anchor. So we'll keep you updated. He made it sound like it wasn't a big deal. You should have seen it. The wind, I don't know what the wind is, but it's crazy. And I'm gonna flip the camera around so you can see the flag flying. I know we're underway, so it's a little deceiving. But uh, this is what we're coming up on. Uh, you see how windy it is. Uh, we're getting ready to go under a bridge. Do you know what bridge this is? Oh, I don't. I think it's, uh, it's the McClatch Fixed Bridge. It's a fixed bridge, but it's really, um, it's really high, so got nothing to worry high. about. 66 feet high. So um, anyway, just started out today, so we'll catch you later. So we're looking, uh, checking out our surroundings. It looks like there's a huge cruise ship or ferry or something parked on that side. Up ahead, we see a bridge. We're following idle time. And then we see the more Peoria over here.
we got some weirdness going on. Yeah, we, uh, we're coming up on a lock, and the lock is closed, and so we're going to go right over the dam. They can move through the whole bay. And uh, so idle time is ahead of us, and the wickets are down for the dam. It's a wicket dam. Wickets? Neither, what are, what's wickets? Neither one of us have ever done that before, so I guess they lower, they lower this wicket. This, and, uh, like and a gate? Just go over it, yeah. So, yeah, so we don't have to go through the lock and tie up and go up or down because the lock is closed. So they're telling us just to drive around on the dam side. <laughs> the dam side. <laughs> Sorry, Mom. Um, anyway, uh, we are going to uh, show you what that looks like when we get a little closer. And um, this is the kind of thing that we see quite a bit. The Roger K Shaw. Whoops. So uh, it's the kind of thing that happens, you know, real time in the on the bridge, right, Sammy boy? Yeah, right. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
back with you uh, rolling down the river passing the Sarah Hunter on the two which means on his left side his port side our starboard that's the Sarah Hunter and we call uh, the barge traffic on channel 13 and uh, the tow captains are very professional and uh, just a pleasure to work with they're just kind of motoring along and are maybe, you going to call them? Maybe four knots. Uh, we've already called them and oh. got permission to pass on the two whistle. Oh. So we're just going along here. And one of the things is uh, just kind of doing some secretarial work. We, about 20 miles ago, we passed 2,000 miles on the Great Loop. <laughs> 2,000 <laughs> miles? 2,000 miles on the Great Loop. Yeah, oh, so my goodness. 2,000 miles. Yeah, wow. I've got to show you this. It's really cool. Pretty cool, huh? Oh my goodness. They're still shocking to me. They're so big. Yeah, they're big. That one looks like some kind of chemical barge. Uh, it's got a red flag on it, which means uh, it's hazardous cargo. Oh, really? And uh, if we were in a lock, uh, we could go through with that particular barge. Uh, it does sometimes say... you can't go through the, the barges with them, but not if they're a red flag. So, it does say uh, danger warning on the side of it. Sarah Hunter, this is being here to us. Sarah, to your toe. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. <laughs> what did he say? Roger, have a good one. All right, All right. so you got Going to see Sammy river. in action with the barge traffic. Just about getting ready to uh, go into our final approach mode here. Wanted to give you an update. We are about five and a half miles from our destination. We will have covered almost 80 miles today. And of course, we went over our 2,000 miles wow. on the Great Loop. 80 miles. So where we're going to be tying up tonight was we gave up an anchorage for tying up at Logston Tug Service. So we're going to be tying up to a barge. The great thing is they have showers there, I guess. Oh, okay. And, uh, and a map of the town, and so we're going to get out to the town of Beardstown. So that's where we're going to be. Another unknown <laughs> when we get there. So, yeah, uh, so check out this view of the river. Yeah. A lot of riverfront property here. <laughs> a lot of riverfront property. And haven't seen a barge for nearly 15 miles, so... Are they all gone? They may be all gone for now. So, anyway, thanks for joining really us on here. one of our longest days on the Great Loop. And, right. uh, but it's been pretty smooth sailing, and we got a plan in place to get the bow thruster fixed. Hopefully, yep, we got a good. part ordered, and we're hoping it's nothing more than that part. So, uh, we'll keep you updated. <laughs> thanks for joining us on the Here's to Us. We'll see you next time. Bye.